Mexico with Royal LePage Top Producers and today I have Audra with me from Audra's Sweet Delights. So in this video series of our local business of the week, I think this is honestly probably one of the interviews I'm most excited for um, because how old are you Audra? I'm 14. Okay, so how long have you been um, baking and what got you started? I've been baking since I was little and I bake because I get stressed out and anxiety and baking is like my therapy. Okay, so how does, I guess, how does baking help you with your anxiety? Um, I just like the creative and decorating part of it. It's just relaxing. Okay. So you started Audra's Sweet Delights, what is it, one year ago, kind of? Um, six months ago, Okay. I'd say, in August. Okay, and from people that I've talked to, you kind of like the local celebrity baker in the neighborhood. So tell me, what, what kind of things do you bake? Um, I mainly do cupcakes, but I do cookie sandwiches, which seem to be very popular. Yeah. And I do monster balls, which is like a large cake ball. It's like misformed <laughs> with googly eyes. <laughs> They're kind of cute. <laughs> <laughs> they sound delicious. Um, and I do meringues and peanut butter cookies. Yeah. What is what's your favorite thing to bake? Probably cupcakes. Okay. I like the decorating and the creative, like decorating part of it. Yeah. I've seen a lot of your cupcakes and they're very ornate and fun in the decorations and things like that. Um, okay, and now I, you also do like a lot of volunteer work and stuff like that. Um, yes, I volunteer for Cakes for Kids Winnipeg and I do a bake sale every year and I just, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, what, it, like, what is your goal with your business? What do you want to, to keep doing and what do you want the River Park South people to know about you? Um, my goal is to, in grade 11, I want to go to MITT or the Arts and Technology Trading School and I'd graduate with a, what's it called, a diploma and a uh, certificate in baking and then awesome. go to Red River for baking and culinary. That would be awesome. I feel like there'd be a lot of good school, good food <laughs> if you had to go to that school. Um, so now you have a Facebook page that has um, your baking and all that kind of stuff on it. If somebody wants to order baking from you, what do they need to do? Um, that's all through my business page, which is Audra Sweet Delights, and I just take all orders through like the messaging part on that. Okay, awesome. And so people can order cupcakes, cookies, all kinds of different delicious things from you, right? I don't really do cakes yet. I've done a couple small cakes, okay. but I'm not super comfortable with the decorating on that yet, yeah. but I'm still working on it, trying to get better. Okay, perfect. Is there any other um, fun fact that you want anybody to know about you or something that's really important that you want other people to know? Um, I suffer from general and social anxiety and want people to know that because like when people come to pick up cupcakes I'm very shy and quiet at the door yeah <laughs> and I'm very awkward I think that that's just that's just because I'm shy <laughs> for sure so it's just to have that level of understanding yeah. right that you're awesome and you do a great job with this baking but just um, when people are picking it up to be understanding that you may not be as outgoing or whatever as they, they Not are expecting. Talkative. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Cool. Well, thank you so much, Audra. I really appreciate this. I'm so excited to get to know you. And I, for me, like seeing young people who have that entrepreneurial spirit and that drive and that motivation to to build their own businesses and do awesome things like this, it, it makes me so excited. So um, we're going to have Audra's page uh, linked on the video here. You guys can reach out to her if you want any baking or anything like that done because we want to support these local businesses and we want to help this girl succeed and be the best baker in all of Winnipeg. So 
Thank you, River Park South. This is our local business of the week. We'll take care and talk to you later. Bye-bye.